have been a, like I would say I've been a creator all of my life. I have always been fascinated with like building and making and I think like, you know, a little bit later on in my adolescence and early 20s, I started to see myself like not only as a person who made things, but maybe somebody who had something to say with the things that I made. When you look back and you take the long view of the role of the artist in the church, the artist has always been someone who has called people back to God. I really want my work to be approachable and I want it to draw people um, into some sort of conversation or into some sort of understanding. And I think using the, the material language of textiles helps to do that. So for this group of work, as I think about Advent and this season that we're in, we live in in the time in history when we ha we know Jesus and we he has like already come, but we are again waiting for him to come back. And so as you look at these pieces, each one is a circle, um, and the embroidery is inside the circle, uh, but there is also an empty space in the middle, and um, the stitching fills the space between. So there is the outer circle, um, and then there is some sort of inner shape and. You'll see the empty inside and the stitches fill the space between the shapes. The pieces that I made for this Advent season are all around the, um, the weeks of Advent. And so they're themes of joy and hope and peace and faith. And those like four things, even as I was signing, um, signing the backs of them and writing, uh, you know, hope 2020, peace 2020, I'm thinking <laughs> like, Actually, these things are here. They're, they're just hard to lead with right now. Um, but uh, God is present and He is near and he's, he's not going anywhere even though there's a lot of things that are really hard in our world right now.